when you are doing experiments with signal um, circuits, oscillators, um, sometimes you need uh, an AC signal that has a certain uh, amplitude, a certain output voltage. And all these generators here, like you can find them in hobby shops, etc., like this one, um, often don't give a higher output than uh, 0.8 volts. That's also the case here, this Cine wave uh, generator. But this Darlington circuit can amplify that uh, small signal to a substantial level. Let's say approximately 20 volts. And when the output signal is too high, you can weaken it by means of this potentiometer circuit. I did not test this part of the circuit, but I'm sure it will work. So this is a Darlington. It amplifies and of course due to the non-linear amplification it also gives uh, a sort of distortion to the wave that you've put in. When you put in a square wave signal it is not distorted at the output, but when you put in a sine wave signal here you will find this waveform more or less a square wave and you can change the waveform by lowering the input volume here or changing the working point from the Darlington. Now I change the working point from the Darlington by tuning, aligning the 10k potentiometer in the circuit. It's connected to the base from the first transistor of the Darlington, so the voltage on that base changes now and has a very substantial influence on the amplification from the input signal. So it's an easy circuit to make and useful in all kinds of experiments. The BD139 is a medium power um, NPN transistor. These are the pin connections, emitter collector base. When you look at the transistor at the front, um, it can handle approximately 3 to 6 watts and the current amplification is between 70 and 150. So here the minimum amplification from this circuit is uh, 70 times 70. So that's a lot. I use the BD139 often because the collector and the base voltage are the same. And as far as, far as I can remember, that's 80 volts. Of course, watch the data sheet to get the real information. So, I think this is a useful circuit when you want to do uh, experiments and you need a substan substantial output voltage from your uh, generator. I switch to uh, the next stage from the uh, generator. This was um, 200 Hertz and now we gonna watch 2000 Hertz. I have to change the time base now. One moment. 2000 Hertz. Um, change the input volume from the signal generator. Change the working point from the Darlington.
Now we go to 20,000 Hz. Change the time base again. And now I change the working point from Darlington at 20,000 Hz by uh, aligning the 10k potentiometer. And now I change the input volume from the generator. So you can see that it is a versatile circuit. Useful for uh, a lot of experiments and applications.